In today's world, social media has great power. It's no secret that among all these social media platforms, Twitter takes the cake when it comes to voicing one's opinions and raising awareness. For this very reason and a few others, Twitter still has a lot going for it even after so many years after it was initiated. While we all know what goes on Twitter and what it really is, do we know who the real owner of Twitter is? Who's the real owner of Twitter? Let's have a look and see. Number 5. The Story of Twitter The story of Twitter goes all the way back to 2006 when four men named Jack Dorsey, Evan Williams, Biz Stone and Noah Glass contemplated the idea of using text messages as statuses. The early idea of text messages can be traced back to Dorsey, who was the one who came up with it. A month later, they came with the name Twitter and the credit for it has to be given to Noah Glass. Jack Dorsey was also the one who sent out the first tweet on the 21st of March. It took Twitter one year to get the bump that it needed. It was by Southwest Interactive and from then, there was no looking back for Twitter. The usage increased massively and Twitter had around 60,000 tweets every day, which increased from 20,000 tweets per day. The next year saw a million tweets per quarter, which was huge at the time. This was when Twitter had a step ahead and decided to introduce its feature of verification which allowed celebrities to have verified accounts. In 2010, Twitter received its first tweet from outer space when NASA astronaut TJ Creamer made it possible. Number 4. Gaining Popularity Twitter is one of the most influential social media platforms. It's a multi-billion dollar company which evolved the whole scenario of news coverage. It has also helped people put out their political points of view, which in turn has revolutionized the entire political discourse. Back in the day, many famous people were unaware of what the whole thing was about. From Bradley Cooper to Christian Stewart, nobody really knew what it was. Actress Sienna Miller went ahead to say that she won't be Twittering. When it first came to the surface, the little startup by the four guys didn't have very bright chances of succeeding. When Jack Dorsey pitched the idea of an SMS-based communication platform, he had no idea what he was stepping into. Slowly, famous people began to know about it as Rosaria Dawson stated how she heard about Twitter when there was an earthquake in California depicting the reach and importance it held even back in the day. This is when users realized how it could help spread meaningful and crucial information across regions. Following a disputed presidential election in Iran, Protesters organized a political campaign through Twitter in 2009, which again gave it a greater meaning in the world. Number 3. Elon Musk Enters the Game While we know who created Twitter, do we really know who owns it at this point in time? Let's get into the details of the real owner of Twitter. On the 14th of April, Elon Musk made a huge claim and stated how he was going to buy Twitter. This surely came out as big news for everyone out there. The price he stated for the purchase was $43 billion. He had already spent $3 billion in order to purchase a chunk of 9% of the business and right after he was aiming to buy the entire thing. The 9% shares made him the biggest shareholder which intrigued everyone to find out what was coming next. However, at the end, Musk pulled out of the deal, citing Twitter's dishonesty about the actual number of active users on the platform. For more such videos, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you never miss out on the latest updates and notifications. Number 2. So who currently owns Twitter? From what we've seen on Twitter's most recent 10k form filed on 10th of February of this year, the total common stock outstanding was somewhere around 800.64 million. You see, institutional investors, for those who don't know, are investment banks, mutual funds and hedge funds were at the top of the food chain, dominating ownership of stocks and making up approximately 70% of Twitter shares. Wall Street Zen data reported on July 25th of 2022 that 20% of Twitter stocks were owned by none other than company insiders and the remaining 10% were owned by retail investors. Among institutional investors were BlackRock, Vanguard Group and Morgan Stanley. The three of them were right at the top of the list of shareholders with 6.70, 10.78 and 4.95% ownership of stocks respectively. Number 1. The Biggest Shareholders If we were to look at the SEC filing from April of this year, we'd find 9% of Twitter being in the possession of Elon Musk, which makes him the one with the biggest share of Twitter. 
Apart from him, Jack Dorsey, the founder of Twitter, and Saudi Prince Al Walid bin Talal are also major shareholders with 2.67 and 4.57% respectively. However, if we were to not look at it from what individuals own the biggest shares, then Twitter's biggest shareholders, who are controlling about 20% of the stock, would be, well, Elon Musk, but joined by him would be Vanguard Group, as we've already said, with Musk having 9% and Vanguard Group almost 11% of the stocks. This was our objective take on who the real owner of Twitter is. Thank you so much for watching the video.